Our rain from yesterday, we had over half an inch officially in Springfield, close to four tenths in Decatur. Three quarters on the nose there for Taylorville. So uh, some heavy downpours certainly yesterday combined with some more ice in some spots as well. So these might not be quite as high as some of you might expect today. We've already seen some heavy rain come down as well. Uh, you'll notice here four tenths of an inch in Springfield, half inch in Taylorville. So they have an inch and a quarter now officially in Christian County. Big uh, increase from where we have been. Hopefully this is going to help with those drought concerns that we've been dealing with here in central Illinois basically all winter long. We haven't seen much snow. We got a little bit more over the weekend combined with this rain. I think that's going to help us out a little bit more here. Rain chances for the rest of the day look slim until about 9, 10 o'clock tonight, and that's when those rain chances really ramp up. Heavy downpour for us through early Wednesday morning. It starts to slide down after 6 o'clock. I do expect for the morning drive for most of us, though, that we will be dealing with that rainfall. And then by the afternoon Wednesday, we're really starting to dry out again. Slight scattered rain chances there for us, but they won't be heavy. What it looks like heading into tomorrow, adding on maybe another quarter inch, we get into Wednesday another quarter inch, and then Saturday we might have another light rain coming our way as well. So very Unsettled weather pattern continues for us, but the good news is we are much warmer here heading into the next few days. Upper 30s today, we're getting away from that freeze mark here. Mid 30s tonight, I think we'll maybe drop down 34. That would be about it for us with that fog kind of hanging around. And then getting through tomorrow into uh, the rest of this week, mid 40s next week. 50s coming back into play, going to be much warmer for us by the time we head towards next weekend. Don't miss a video. Subscribe to our YouTube channel today for more Central Illinois news.